Okay, let's create a new project. So to do that, we can either go up here into the file menu, say new, or we can actually also go down there and that's the most common. So in this toolbar down here, we have the new button, create a new project, uh, you name it, awesome Gatling. And uh, this geometry path is where you browse for a model. So when you you get asked to uh, pick a mesh, so uh, in my case I have uh, have it on a on a drive. Um, so we have the option to load ABC, FBX, and OBJ. So ABC is alembic. Uh, so this one is an OBJ. Open it. So we get uh, mesh options here and um, UV if available is, uh, is the default. Um, so you can force it to be PTEX. So if it was a uh, object that didn't contain any UVs, it will switch to force PTEX. We're not gonna load a um, PTEX object because I have UVs. Um, so the prefix window, this is, um, so this one you can configure in your in the file somewhere. I, I haven't done it. So you can, uh, load like, uh, different set of presets. So you could have maybe names that's specific to you or uh, to you or your studio. Uh, I usually create the uh, channels uh, on the fly in the object or in the the archive. But uh, let's say if I say create dirt, uh, so that's gonna create a channel that's called dirt. This is where you set the patch size. So you have the option to go up to 32K. Let's stick with 2K. So you can tell it to be um, what color space you want the channel to be in if you paint in sRGB or uh, in my case I can set it to linear and swap this to 16 bit then um, yeah and down in the bottom you have a color space bar so this is you can override the default ones that's set I'm not gonna do this uh, on this one I'll, I will stick with the nuke default um, that makes most sense for me at the moment um, when I paint. So in uh, if you work on a studio, you might have this set up to different like ACES or ACES CG or uh, completely different. So there's a few one that ships with um, uh, Mari default. So ACES IIF, I don't know what it is. Uh, SB, Anim and VFX, that's on the pictures image works. Don't really know what those does either. So nuke default is the one that most like most similar to the nuke one. That so what happens if you would load a uh, sRGB image, for example, it will linearize if it's a JPEG or 8-bit. It will uh, linearize it in uh, when you import the image uh, into the image manager. So you will paint with a kind of a linear value. So let's hit OK, and now it should create your object um, and set up the channel. So let's look at the channel now. So there we have it, the dirt uh, was the one that I created. Yeah. Cool. Now you have your first project. See you in the next chapter.